Good day, kings and queens. I'm in my bathroom. I have um, limited space up under my cabinet. So I bought some organization tools, you know, spring cleaning so I can maximize the vertical space in this bathroom. I just want to give you some tips and tools to help you so it can be more organized and clear so we can find what we need instead of going out buying more stuff that we already have. And it's actually not too bad because I keep up on it, but the um, organization tools that I picked up uh, really help. So I'll have where I picked up everything from in a link in my description box. And I'll even probably try to iCard it if I remember in this video so you can see that video. And know where to pick up some items that work really well, very inexpensively. Okay, let's get right into it. Like, share, and subscribe, kings and queens. Okay, here we are. So, uh, I like to be able to see everything. So it's some products that I do have that I use on a regular, but I can't fit in here because as you can see, it's so small, I can't fit everything in here, you know. So what I would do to maximize that vertical space going from the top to the bottom, you can see I got some vertical space still all along this wall that I could use. So I could put more stuff in here and have it available, okay? Also, in this drawer, I already started last year um, organizing this, but um, as you can see, it's can use a little work, so I'll show you what I will do to touch that up too as well. And if you're interested, this is the label maker that I use. It's um, Brother PT45, okay? So these are the three items that I'm using. This one is um, the cabinet shelf. Um, from essentials okay and then this is my marble lined paper and I just use this um, good, good tip you all take one of the little pipe wires cut it in half tie it that way you can use it for another project I just use this to line my shelf with and um, this little tray that was already in there um, cut retray and that's going to be to organize all the um, hair essentials just put them back in there all right okay kings and queens here it is um, eventually I want to get to the place where I'm just making all my products myself less toxins so um, that's where you see the label maker so they can notice this pine saw in here, baking soda for when I make my cleaning products. When we have to get into those little hard to reach areas, this is the cleaning toothbrush. And you'll see why I put cleaning on this one because I have another toothbrush for other stuff. I was able to get everything back in here and I was able to add an item. Use this little rack for the scrubber. Toilet brush back there, another towel to wipe down the counter, towel to wipe down if some on the floor. Um, with three little cleaning products back there. And yeah, really nice and simple. I can see everything and everybody knows exactly where everything is. And this is how this came out. Um, all of the bigger brushes I have over here. I laid them opposite ways so they could fit. And it's three of those. Soft brushes. Then a rat tooth comb. I was able to fit everything back in here with space for more items actually. The bigger tooth combs. Flat, flatter combs. The thinner combs. And then here... Um, I put the label maker on this toothbrush because this is for hair edges. And, um, okay, and then just some clips, um, trimmer scissors, little hair ties and everything in here. That way they can see everything. 
and just a shower cap here and a shower cap here. This little gadget for the silverware that goes in the kitchen works so great in this bathroom, you all. Thank you, for kings and queens, for watching. Like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.